Hello, welcome to Guided Jewish Meditations. My name is Eliezer. The wisdom of the Torah precedes all of existence. It is the blueprint that was used to create everything in reality. The wisdom of the infinite source of all. In this wisdom, the Creator speaks of two genders, man and woman, two opposites and halves of a single whole, separated at creation and given the task of finding their way back towards each other in harmony, balance and peace and becoming one in the holy act of the intimate physical union of man and woman. Within the words for man, Ish, and woman, Isha, lies an ancient divine secret of immense importance and radiance, wisdom and insight. And today we will delve deeply into these two words, into their letters and their spiritual light, revealing some of this wisdom. Please find a place where you can sit or lay down and remain undisturbed. This meditation is an expression of your soul and for your soul to experience its light and consciousness. Your body must first feel relaxed and safe, content with this moment in your life. Allow yourself to fully relax and try to let go just a little bit of any feelings of stress, anxiety, pain or expectations you may be experiencing. Begin breathing deeply, slowly and evenly. As you breathe in, experience the air entering you. Allow your mind to flow into this air with every breath. The air that nourishes your body and fills your soul with life and light. And with every exhaling of your lungs, let go a little bit more of any negative energies you may be feeling. Every breath is another cycle of cleansing and healing. Allow your mind to infuse itself with this rhythmic cycle, becoming one with it. As we begin this journey of man and woman, Ish and Isha, infused with the wisdom of the Torah.
you open your mind's eye and behold before you the vast expanses of the spiritual fabric of your mind. It is still and dark, and you are surrounded on all sides by the weightlessness of this world, the gentle warm air that surrounds you, slowly moving in all directions. You breathe in deeply and allow this air to fill your lungs with its spiritual energy, infusing itself with your mind and soul. You experience a sensation of complete security and balance in this world, a place and time when you can truly be yourself. As you allow your mind to focus on this space before you, you behold the emergence of two points of light appearing from the darkness ahead of you, rapidly growing larger and brighter. You see them expand into two furnaces of divine energy and light. With every fire emitting radiating pulses of spiritual energy in all directions around them. Briefly blinded by their radiance, brilliance and light, you allow your mind to slowly focus on these two spiritual fires before you. The one on the right radiates with millions of shades of bright white light, while the one on the left bursts forth with untold shades of brilliant red light. Breathlessly raging, with the cacophony of colors within each fire, causing each side to expand with uncontrolled fury and intensity. You see them grow and move before you. The white one on the right side and the red one on the left, filling your mind and soul with their spiritual energy. Your meditation on these two fires intensifies, and you see the composition and energies of the two furnaces before you begin to change. Black fire emerges from within the core of each of them, briefly shooting out in all directions, and then forming the two letters Aleph and Shin, and combining them to form the word for fire, Aish. As this word completes its formation in each of these two raging infernos, you behold and experience the spiritual intensity of this ancient word, Aish. Fire, a symbol for raw 
and uncontrolled passion. Without balance between the Aleph and the Shin. And without order between the colors of each fire. This word captures the raging inferno of chaos and discord within each side. Continue meditating on these two brilliant sources of light, each within their own color patterns, and on the word Aish, fire, contained within each of them, and allow their meaning and energy to illuminate your mind and soul. As your meditation continues, you behold the two flames before you begin to interact. A spiritual tension begins to build between them as you experience the true nature of these two fires before you. The white fire on the right, masculine in its nature to give and project, and the left red fire, feminine in its nature to receive and to mold, forging a dichotomy of roles that begins to form before you. Approaching each other and reaching out with brilliant leaps of flame and light, you see the letters of the white fire to the right reach out and connect with the letters of the red fire to the left. Making contact, you behold before you an immediate increase in radiating light, briefly illuminating the entire world around you as the intensity of the light within each fire increases violently and suddenly, but then quickly grows dark and cold, leaving nothing of the intensity behind. Then you see the letters of the fire to the left reach out as well and connect with the letters on the right. Again, they briefly connect, causing another intense reaction of passion and light. But then, just as quickly as earlier, the reaction grows cold and dark, leaving nothing behind. You breathe in deeply and try to understand the puzzle unfolding itself before you. Focusing on the letters of the Torah that are contained within each side, the Aleph and the Shin, spelling the word Ish, fire. You allow the wisdom contained within to reach you. Male and female each side containing the raw and unbalanced sexual energies that their colors represent. You understand 
that within each side's range of colors lies a balanced center. One single shade of color that represents the whole. Focusing on this truth, you prepare your mind and soul for the breathtaking conclusion of this visualization. From a distant point on the horizon, a divine name containing just two letters appears. A Yud and a He materialize before you, and they shine forth and illuminate the entire sky before you as they approach the two raging fires of color and energy. The Yud comes to rest above and between the Aleph and the Shin, contained within the white fire to the right, and the He concludes its journey above and after the Shin, within the red fire to the left. As you breathe in deeply, you allow your mind to focus on the letters before you, as the light within each fire begins to absorb the spiritual energy contained within the two letters of this sacred name. To the right, the Yud descends in between the Aleph and the Shin, spelling the word Ish, man. And to the left, the He descends and comes to rest after the Shin, spelling the word Isha, woman. As the two letters complete their formation into these two new words, Ish, man, and Isha, woman. You behold the center of each fire begin to pulsate and radiate outwards, overcoming the chaotic movements of its raging core as a calm and beautiful divine energy spreads throughout each side. To the right, the fire has locked in a single shade of white, containing all its male attributes into one single shade of white. And to the left, the fire has turned a single shade of red, balancing all its female qualities into one shade of red. You allow your mind to behold and take in the two sides before you. The male side, the Ish, has achieved an equilibrium of its unique masculine energies and qualities, 
with the spiritual addition of the Yud and the female side, the Isha, has found its unique feminine balance and equilibrium in the spiritual addition of the He. Take a few moments and allow your mind to focus on these two sides, each one no longer a raging and uncontrolled fire, but rather calm and strong, unique and resolute, full of purpose and well along a divinely ordained path of self-discovery and appreciation. As you behold each side before you, you begin meditating on the radiating secret and wisdom contained within. It is the Torah that teaches mankind how to find peace within the self, to discover that within every man and within every woman exists the possibility of an infinite range of shades of masculinity and femininity. And yet, through the connection of the soul with the infinite source of all, whose name forms this balance of the genders, and whose divine letters contain within them this deep secret, that all these shades of colors are contained within and divided in two, only two genders, man and woman. As you allow this eternal truth and infinite wisdom to truly radiate from within your mind and soul, you breathe in deeply and you behold the two sides before you begin to slowly approach one another. In a breathtaking display of symmetry and balance, of radiating energy and of spiritual light, you see the Ish to the right and the Isha to the left. Meet in the middle in a deep, holy embrace, the lights of both fires merging into one, with the divine name Yud and He, joined once again, two souls no longer apart, united once again.
we have arrived at the end of this visualization meditation. Please take a few moments to bring your mind and body back to a normal, present state of consciousness. Breathe slowly and deeply until you have fully returned. Thank you for joining me today. It is the Torah that carries within all the wisdom needed to answer the questions of every generation. And I hope this meditation has contributed a little bit on this eternal journey for truth. My name is Eliezer. May peace be with you.